Hey everyone, Nuni here, welcome back to New Grimoire. So, today's episode we're going to look into one of the biggest problems we have, or at least two of the biggest problems we have. Um, one, of the, one of the first problems, and probably the main focus of the episode, is going to be the healthcare uh, situation. We're going to look into it. It's always popping up more and more, and it just doesn't seem that we have enough resources. And looking into some of the cl clinics, probably we don't. But we also have to address another problem. Another problem we have, which is public transportation. I'm not entirely sure or happy with the way we have our public transportation system. We have 70,000 people uh, in our city, but uh, only 59,000 are using our public transportation system. And it's not really the amount I was thinking or hoping. We do have a lot of people using taxis. There's a lot of traffic uh, and congestion sometimes. Uh, mo mostly on the rush hours, you do have traffic accidents and all of that. And the fact is, we have not really and properly worked through our public system or public transportation system as much as I probably wanted or should. Uh, the fact is, we've built. There's there's been a couple of episodes where we've built uh, public transportation updates or new 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 um, transportation systems like the subway, the tram. Um, bus lines and all of that but the fact is it doesn't seem like we are doing it properly and for that very specific reason I think we need to start updating our uh, public transportation looking at bus stops looking at subway uh, stations and stops looking at tram stops and tram network um, looking at all of these things because the downtown and uh, Bedford Crossing it's really very heavy when it comes to you know the the amount of um, you know people leaving moving around and um, it's a very dense area uh, we also have old town that we build a tram line it's not being used because most people are using the buses because the buses in the end they they give a lot more priority and they have I mean they have other locations and probably better destinations than just using the tram lines so what we're going to be doing is, today's episode we're going to be focusing uh, mostly on building the um, hospital. We definitely need an hospital in here. I think I have the perfect location. I believe this in here will be a good location for it. It's near to the highway so um, and, and also near to the downtown and eventually here to Bradford Crossing also. Um, I am, although, thinking we should probably connect this in here and we will have a nice, probably a nice connection that... Uh, should work in one way or another um, which is not bad by the way so we are going to look into how we're going to fix some of this how we're going to make this a better place for all these people living in here I mean listen if I've been talking in here and there's been a reduced number of people waiting for ambulances but I'm pretty much sure we still have a big problem with when it comes to that uh, to that regard. So, first things first, let's build the hospital. I believe here is the best location for the hospital, and that's what we're gonna do. So I'll just speed up things, and um, after I finish the hospital, I'll let you guys know. Uh, one thing I also want to do, and I think it's extremely important, um, is kind of uh, I may have to rework. A couple of things in here including uh, this road in here Briar Rose um, Rose Street we do Briar Rose Street has a connection to the highway and I think this should be our main road this is where we're gonna have the hospital I mean the hospital probably is gonna be connected through this road in here but it's gonna have an easy access to the highway but we also should update this road in here so up until to this roundabout um, this should always be the main road and then I'm thinking going upwards should also be good we do have like a nice amount of road space that can create that we can use to have like a, a, a larger Avenue uh, not in here unfortunately not a problem though we can do a bit of moving around things we are going to lose this business unfortunately unfortunately we are going to lose this business or or maybe we we'll lose these other two business move the high school um, 
Yeah, you see, there's a couple of options we can have. Uh, nothing, uh, I have to be honest, no option in here is going to be good for what we want to do. We need to, so even before I start building the, uh, <laughs> even before I start building the hospital, we need to upgrade this road. I think it is the first thing we need to do. And then do a connection to here. And eventually with this connection in here, we're also going to destroy this area in here, these roads. Uh, and uh, yeah, there's, I, I don't think there's anything we can do. There's anything that, yeah, we're gonna lose a little bit, but it is what it is. And um, I just have to see what will have less damage to our city. And I think what will have a little bit less damage is definitely destroying these two buildings. Um, this is a lot of jobs, but it's just jobs. They're not going to lose houses. We can still keep the, 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 the high school in here. They're also going to lose... Yeah, well, there's going to be a couple of losses around here. These are going to be smaller buildings. But we don't really have to say they're gonna be small. Let's do this and then I'll 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 come back to you guys.
Alright guys, so as you guys can see, we now have a lot of lash issues when it comes to um, our healthcare. We have a lot, a lot less people waiting for the ambulance. This new hospital area, I am filling it with commercial buildings and offices around here. Also a little bit to uh, kind of compensate the issue that we have to destroy <laughs> these uh, couple of businesses around here. There's a lot of uh, parking lot in, in behind of the hospital. If people want to go to the hospital, which they can by the way, they um, the back entrance is not the best, but you you know you can park your car here and then you walk around. Um, this is an alley road, so it's not the most uh, secure of them all, but it is what it is. And yes, there's a couple of um, commercial businesses in here. Now these are small businesses. Um, I'm okay with small businesses, uh, and then you have like these uh, slightly higher density businesses, small ones also, but slightly bigger. Yeah, and they're near to the to the train station, so that's that's cool. I like it. All right, so uh, what else are we going to do? Uh, as you guys saw, we did a new uh, update here on the road. We have now a avenue four lane road, uh, which is nice. Uh, I was thinking about because this is a downtown. I was thinking about increasing it to a six lane, but it, it would be very complicated, mostly because of this section in here, I guess. Uh, it, it's not impossible that in the future we do it, but if we do that in the future, it means that this building is definitely going, uh, it's not going to stay. <laughs> the tallest building we have on our city is not going to stay, it's going away, and, and I, I really do not want that to happen. Um, I don't know, we may have to rethink slightly things around here or what we want to do, uh, but I definitely do not want to do that. And uh, in fact, this section in here, because we do have the, the underground, you know, we have the subway station. I am thinking that eventually if we want to continue these Broad Street uh, as an avenue up here, for instance, we would have to just go through this section in here, destroying a couple more businesses, but not as much. The impact would be a lot less than uh, what we've done it before. Okay, I am kind of happy not a hundred percent happy but kind of happy with the way this is looking like the downtown with the hospital big one um it's working for the entire city so this not it's not a district selected or specific district so right now we have one hospital for the entire city uh financially speaking it's not having any big or huge impact on our uh budget on our um services but you can see we have a lot less issues plus we're not destroying or we're not completely um, disabling these medical clinics this is completely full this one we have another one in here which is not full but it is almost and um, I'm happy for that and in that regard I am happy um, not not entirely you could say I'm not entirely 100% happy but I am happy okay now we have to think about public transportation. That's where uh, things can get a little bit more confusing or a little bit more complicated right now. Because public transportation uh, right now here on the downtown area is not perfect. But because we build the hospital, we want to have good public transport. One thing I want to do is I want to have a bus shelter uh, stop. And I want it to be near to the hospital entrance. I'm not entirely sure where the entrance is. I can see there's some gaps in here. So I would say that if I am going to place a stop, I want to place it around here. Does it make sense? It's near, it, it doesn't close anything and uh, buses, buses, no, not here. Sorry, it's very close there. I, if I am going to add one, it's here. This is the best location. Why? It's kind of like in the middle, buses have enough time to queue around here and still have enough room to get out, to leave. And that's a good um, place to stop. It's not the only public transportation we're going to have. We're going to have to think about what bus line is going to come here to the hospital. But I also want to look into the subway. 
we do need to have a different subway system. Uh, we only have one stop here on the downtown. I kind of want to build one probably around here. So around here is near to the hospital. It's near to these houses. And uh, people, I believe people will like it. I believe people will love this slight situation where you can have public transportation really nearby. So I am thinking probably building one stop here. And this is going to connect somewhere. I'm not entirely sure where. Um, probably here also. Probably here also is not a bad idea. So it would be from the train station, would go connect probably around here. Um, and I'm thinking where else would I want to have a subway station? Maybe around here wouldn't be the worst case scenario. Have a subway station here. Seems like people are liking. <laughs> so that's good. That's cool. Um, I was... And I, I don't know... I, I, think we can con I think we can connect through here. I think we can connect to this area, to this other station, which would be like the end, um, end point. So... If that is the case, let's go... Can we go down? Yeah, we can. Double track. Um, yeah, it. And I think. I'm not really sure even where it connects to here, I guess. Yeah, I think I would go like. As a, to be honest, I think I would go probably around here, like that. And next, I connect this. Maybe I can connect it like that. Doesn't need to be perfect. This is underground. We, we're not going to see these imperfections happening either way. Uh, by the way, I completely forgot. We want to upgrade this to have a subway entrance. And um, this will help out people arriving here through uh, the, um, you know, through here to get to, <laughs> to this bus line. Um, I'm also thinking, I'm also thinking, um, because we do have this bridge, I don't want to do many bridges for the subway. It, 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 it won't make sense. Um, should. Should we go? Um, <laughs> this is good. Listen, I'm gonna do this by myself, and I'll I'll be back to you guys, and I'll explain what was the logic. You can still see the logic moving around it uh, on a very very specific um, speed run. So yeah, <laughs> I think it's gonna be fun. <laughs>
subway is built. It's not perfect because of the downtown subway uh, line, but let's look at uh, the subway if we can. Let's look here. Let's turn on these. Let's just turn off the green line. I do not want to see it so we can see just the red line itself. Uh, kind of. Okay. So basically what happens is we grab a bus from uh, a subway from here, which is kind of like the end point in Brad Cross, Brad, Bradford Crossing. We then stop here, which we don't have much going on yet. There's still a good enough space around here. You do have a college, you know, not nearby, so you could probably use this one. It then connects to here, to the train station, which is not bad. Um, this is okay. I mean, this kind of curve is okay. From the train station to this area near to the hospital, which is not really the hospital, but the, this downtown area, kind of, air, uh, north downtown area, if you want to call it that way. Uh, this is very bad. Uh, in reality, it would never happen. It would. Uh, in reality, I don't think these two subways would connect each uh, themselves. Uh, or at least not on this way, they probably could do like a specific, um, different way. But I mean, this is a game after all, it, it, it doesn't have to be super realistic. Uh, eventually, if I see a better way to do it, I'll do it. Uh, then we have the downtown. Uh, this downtown station, we have two, um, two lines going through here on the same track. So we have the, 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 the red and the green lines. Um, Realistically speaking, you could have in one station these two lines, but they wouldn't do the same tracks. They wouldn't, they wouldn't work on the same tracks. They would work on different way of tracks. Uh, I don't think we have on this underground uh, unless there's an update. No, the only upgrade you have is for food, is just for comfort. Uh, what I'm saying is that in here, in this um, very specific situation, you would have the green and the and the red lines. They they, they Honestly, they wouldn't be too uh, fancy. Uh, they wouldn't use the same the same tracks. That's that's what I'm saying. Maybe in the future another update is gonna come and uh, we will be able to uh, fix this situation where we can have underground uh, subway stations that have multiple track le levels, and that could help uh, develop all of this area. And then we had one here. Uh, we had another. A subway station here on the Old Town connection uh, which I'm not sure if we're gonna have a lot of people but this is still from the red line uh, and that's it there's no, no nothing else going on around here we uh, by the way let me just type in this walking path so people can move around I could even make all this area for the subway which will, will definitely look a little bit better now that we have the surface tool, we can do we can do things like this, you know. Uh, if I can do it properly, I'll do it uh, as best as I can. What is this? I have no idea what that is. It's a lot of people over there, isn't it? Yes, it is. Lots of people there. Are there waiting for something? What are you? Going home. What are you waiting for? Subway. Maybe it's the subway station. They're waiting for the subway. I'm not sure. There's like a lot of people here. And I'm not sure what they're waiting for. Um, that's strange. That is really strange. We don't, we don't have any other stop other than just the, 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 the subway. I guess that's... I guess that's a subway. If you go, no, it's they're, they're there. I'm not sure what they're doing here. Probably a bug. Either way. Um, cool, 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 cool. So we have the subway station here, and that's it for the subway. And we get a better subway system right now through here. What we don't have properly is a bus station, uh, a bus stop. I'm sorry. We do have this new location where we can have a bus stop, but we're not having a bus stop. Uh, we will add one though. I think we can, um, without any questions, add this 
stop here with these uh, B07 bus line. Uh, the B07 bus line, it goes here, right? It goes here, yeah. So there, there's connectivity in the bus station. Um, it's not the, because mo mostly what happens is the B07 line, so the bus bus line seven, it, it moves around the downtown, basically. It's not the worst, uh, I would say it. Um, there's a couple of <laughs> good ways of, of saying it in, in, in that regard. Um, there's a stop here, there's a stop here, stop here, which is not too bad, um, and a stop here. So, and then, and then it goes here to, to the technical university and goes back. Yeah, I mean it's not it's not the worst case scenario. Uh, by the way, let me just upgrade uh, a little bit more for um, why not? Let's have these schools being filled in. It has many people or many students students as we can. Um, okay, I guess that's uh, part of it. What we want there there's. Bradford Crossing still needs to look into some of the public transportation. I think I'm gonna leave that for when we start working more on Bradford Crossing. We do have now a couple of cool areas we can grow up, extend and build up more uh, of our city so people can enjoy it uh, a lot better. Um, I'm thinking about it. I'm pretty much sure it's gonna look really cool. Um, I'm not sure I like to look into here and see how many passengers are using the um, subway. Green line, we have a lot. Uh, it's normal, it's a bigger line. It goes to, uh, as you can see, it goes to here, uh, which probably shouldn't. We should have a different, we should have a different line, uh, a different station, different area. Maybe here in the downtown, this one in here, we should have maybe another uh, subway station right next to it for instance in here it, it, but the problem is the tracks you know we do not want to this was already complicated to to build it it's it's not it's not even good it, it's glitching by the way if you check it out this is glitching uh, but it is what it is you know it's um, it's not something I'm gonna be able to fix that easily this one in here is, is working better it's not glitching as much as that other one I think the problem here has to do with the fact that we have this road and we are not able to fulfill the land um, you know what I'm gonna try to fulfill this land in whatever way I can uh, yeah, it's not, it's not gonna do anything, is it? No, it's not. Can I do it smooth? No, it's the bridge. You know, this bridge is just, yeah, the bridge is just chaotic. And it's not something I'm gonna fix anytime soon, so, yeah, there you go. <laughs> it is what it is, and that's, that, that's it, that's it. Um, okay, guys, I think that's going to be it for today's episode. I hope you guys did enjoy it. Uh, it, it was quite, uh, pleasant for me. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with this area in here, the way it's looking. There's this big building around here. I'm, I'm, I'm okay with this one. I'm happy for this one also. It's, it's, a, it's a good commercial business. It's near to the highway entrance. It's... I don't really like to build these buildings in directly access to this to this avenue. I'm not entirely sure if this one has direct. No, I think this one access is to this road, which is great. Um, not any jobs. I'm happy for that. These are smaller ones. Oh, by the way, let me look into. We still need a couple more commercial, small commercial buildings, and we also need a couple more uh, office buildings. We did build these other offices. They they do have like good amount of jobs in here, and I think it looks good near to the highway to have these small um, offices that are near to the to to the hospital. You know, I think that's okay. Uh, looking before just finishing, guys, I'm just looking at some of our uh, tweets or chips. Uh, I don't know how you would call it, um, and I can see. 
there's there's jobs which seems to be good i guess there's a lot of open jobs in the industry someone is saying that i'm not sure if it's sure i have to check it out later um it does seem like Let me see how it is. Uh, I think we can eventually, and we, we want to bring in more people. Uh, unemployment is off the roof, by the way. Um, it probably happened because we did uh, destroy a couple of jobs, and now I think there's still a bug when it comes to some of these jobs. So yeah, it's, 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 it's kind of, um, yeah. <laughs> it's kind of annoying in, 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 that, in that way, but it is what it is. Um, I'm just thinking, should we level up some of these houses uh, and build new new residential towers, skyscrapers? This is the downtown, by the way. I I'm, I'm okay just having a couple of them. I don't want to have full skyscrapers. But, you know, I'm, I'm just not entirely 100% sure of, of it. But it's something I'm gonna look into the next episode probably and um, next episode we're gonna go do a couple more things I'm not sure what it is but I think we still have a lot of room to expansion I'm thinking Bradford Crossing for sure needs to be properly built or developed in, in, a, in a different way anyways guys thank you very much for watching if you did enjoy subscribe leave a like leave a comment all your comments are always welcome um, even though you probably noticed, I am building these up uh, or recording these up um, in in a couple of days um, of of recording. So if your comment is not seen or thought about in the next couple of episodes, it will be on the future. So don't worry. And um, yeah, that's basically it. Thank you for watching, guys, and I'll see you soon. Cheers. Listening at full volume. And our souls are transported. Mm. But let us not tarry. On to the next episode. This just in from traffic. If you're thinking about hitting the streets, you can expect delays on the major roads, especially.